Hello everyone, welcome to the channel, Rat here from Ratko Tarot and this is going to be Virgo Sun, Virgo Moon and Virgo Rising weekly Tarot and Lenormand reading for uh, December 17 to December 23rd, 2018. So as this is going to be a general reading guys while I'm shuffling the cards, um, I want to remind you that it's going to resonate uh, with every single one of you Virgos in a, a different uh, level because every single one of you are special <clears throat> and your situations differ from uh, one another therefore in this video I will try my best here to explain you the meanings uh, of these cards and their synergy in the spread but uh, unfortunately uh, you have to also help it and make sense of them and to align them to your personal situation now um, if basically want a your situation to be uh, analyzed through tarot that is going to be a subject of a personal reading for which you can check out my website listed down below in the description of this video and there you can find a full list of my services as well as their pricing and uh, don't forget that by the end of uh, the, till the end of uh, December <clears throat> the prices for the 20 and the 30 minute uh, personal reading with me are with reduced cost. So uh, this is going to be as well a, a enhanced tarot spread and I can give you an overview right now but we do have the 10 of swords here sitting in a second position which is the core of the situation. So as this is the core of the situation it does look like a major around turn into a uh, into your life in generally is to happen a do a, a um, how can I place a drastic realization or a drastic measures that you are to take so this is just the overview that we can uh, we can say you know and uh, before we go into these cards or as we go with these cards we are going to draw one additional for every situation so uh, what we do have here <clears throat> the king of pentacles and the temperance card that is going to be your um <clears throat> your outlook for the week or this is the topic of um, of the very week so uh as the topic these cards are pointing that you are to rediscover some sort of a, a new um they, they were not really new but let's say that you are to discover hidden values in your things or things that you thought meaningless until this very moment are to prove themselves into a, a huge value to yourself. So that being said, uh, <clears throat> uh, for the lack of better terms, I will say performance that you thought is a chore of your behalf, either career-wise or either relationship-wise, is going to prove itself very vital for your success either into career or either into relationship. And just so I can touch the subject with um, Uh, with example here, you may be just like me, you know, a guy who doesn't like to make a, uh, a bunch of a makeup, you know, I just, you know, I brush my teeth and I just go out and pff, whatever, I don't really pay much attention to my hair, to my uh, eyelashes and etc, etc, you know, and uh, you may find out, you know, that actually taking a little bit more care about your cosmetics is something that pays off in a tremendous way so uh, but that is just an example again it's not going to be uh, necessarily your situation so what i'm trying to say here is, is that throughout this week you are to find out that a thing you thought as a chore is is paying a, a vital and a crucial role for your future progress either career wise or either relationship wise now in any case is going to involve a certain and compromise and through that compromise you will have to abandon a, a certain positions or a certain um, possessions as well so positions and possessions and uh, that may involve you giving away uh, you know a thing of yours into someone to work with so you can receive in return that could also uh, involve you know you abandoning a standpoint upon a opinion so you know you can reach a common ground with a specific person and etc etc what the point here guys is is that um, <clears throat> even though you're sitting right now on a established pattern which 
usually means that it is quite solid with the king of pentacles in order to uh, benefit even more or in order to achieve better things you know you eventually have to make some um, kind of like some investments if I may express myself that way or to make some compromises or in generally to uh, allow things to be back in stir that is not different but you having money into your bank account you know and just having a, a certain amount of money there flat amount of money and if you want those money to increase you have to invest first into something you know so give some of those money away <clears throat> in order for those money to uh, multiply hopefully you know and come back to your bank account and that way you are increasing your bank account all right so that is just um, an example how i can express myself um so i can make much more sense and that is also a accompanied with a certain sense of insecurity you know because no one really wants to give away some money or in that specific sense uh, you may feel yourself a little bit of a defensive about opening emotionally into a specific person you know because maybe you are used people first to open emotionally to you and uh, if we talk about uh, career, maybe you will have to give up the leadership position just for a, just for a moment here, you know, so you can kind of like uh, <clears throat> show to the people that you are not a godlike person or etc, etc. I'm sorry if I'm not making a good point, you know, but it's just these are the examples that pops up into my mind uh, that involves compromises and in the same time kind of involve uh, realizing that um, <clears throat> by investing or rather by doing things in a slightly different way or recognizing that a thing that you are feeling uncomfortable of doing it is a, a very essential is to play a very essential role in your progress moving on down the down the road regarding your agenda and regarding your dream the ten of swords here accompanied with uh, which is the core of the situation accompanied with the four of pentacles it does expresses only one thing in this case and that is the realization that your positions right now are so rock solid that in its current state actually you alone place yourself in a situation where there is no room for improvement whatsoever therefore some drastic new uh, new strategies and some drastic new st standpoints needs to take place it is likely that you are to draw a line and make a, a huge retrospection and that is no different you know but re by re uh, then revisiting the pl a plan you know and finding a cracks in that plan which cracks are kind of jeopardizing you know uh, the the overall execution of that plan or finding a room where you can actually make new additions new addendum new stipulations into that specific plan so what we do have it is the major around turn just like i said but that around turn will be caused by you recognizing you know that sitting into that specific place either career wise or either relationship wise just for relationship wise to give you an example you know you are sitting in a place where you're just kind of like going out or um, seeing each other with your girlfriend or with your boyfriend only a couple of only a couple of times a week it is because you're working way too much and in the same time you want that relationship to involve to evolve to evolve excuse me well that kind of happens seeing just a couple of times you know you need to make time for more how you're gonna make time for more well by you investing into it by you giving away some of your extra time that you're working you know in order to spend more time with your girlfriend or with your boyfriend no difference so it's kind of like you re-emerging with a new routine here throughout that week and uh, this routine by the looks of it is going to make you much more prepared and much more uh, affectionate to coping with things which until this very moment have proven themselves to be a chores and as I said those chores you are to find that are uh, the essential the very core of your progress of how you are to move on forward so for those Virgos which are feeling blocked which are feeling that they 
cannot experience love in their life, which are which are feeling that there is no progress into their career. Well, this is why, you know, it is because you have placed yourself in that position and now you need to revisit why you are in that position and make the necessary um, <clears throat> unrevocable decisions or irreversible actions in order to uh, kind of like break free from that position and this is not going to happen without you making compromises. The next card that we do have, this is going to be the challenges which are causing predicaments here. We do have the Sun card and just by that card I could say that the situation you are to find yourself after start making those um, you know compromises and new uh, new adopted strategies here and in generally start coping with the predicaments uh, you are not going to feel extremely comfortable and that is completely normal let me draw the additional card here yeah that is the high priestess now definitely this is going to feel rather unnatural for yourself and that could be a reason why um the reason why, excuse me, could be because you have waited or stood way too long into those current patterns and you have defended them with everything you got and now throughout this week, uh, Virgos, you are realizing that you are basically, you know, by defending those patterns, you are doing to yourself more harm than good. And by abandoning those standpoints and those patterns, it is normal that things are not going to feel natural. And kind of like you may not have the knack of how you can uh, perform in those uh, in those new strategies either into your relationship or either into your career if we go with the relationship example here you know uh, maybe you have plans for those couple of uh, couple of times you are to meet your beloved ones you know but when you start meeting much more frequently rather than seldom uh, you may kind of exhaust yourself from ideas what to do you know and that could make you fall into boredom and etc etc and in general it may it may it may not feel natural to spend so much time with this person and you may th start thinking that this is uh, kind of rather stifling than actually making you more um you know more happier but again you need to remember what your goal is if you want more uh kind of like deep relationship well this is what you need to do spending more time with them and that's just one type of an example here if we're talking about projects at work you know and if we follow that example of abandoning a leadership position for the sake of someone else you may find yourself rather uncomfortable taking orders from a specific person you know but in the same time this is gonna help you foresee how people that were beneath you before are working you know and what really is necessary for them to feel good and to feel productive and on top of that you are to find a, a glimpse where the things are not executed correctly but rather than, than wrong because when you dive into the specifics of one work you always have a, a better understanding into it and that is all so you can consolidate your positions now you need to know here with the king of pentacles of a main card this is all so you can make a consolidation so you can um, um how can i explain it uh so you can make your positions rock solid right so even if you abandon their leadership position that leadership position is going to be bring uh brought back to you right and you will be able to take it once again but this time around you will have much better understanding what was wrong into those that were beneath you so it we're talking once again of a matter of a compromise and the ability or rather the willingness of your behalf to abandon for a short amount of time your current patterns so you can experience the situations and the undertakings or the enterprises you name it in the in a different way and that different way is going to present you with the solution that you so require which solution once again is going to involve things which you thought are chores but those chores are to prove themselves very very vital for the um, overall success to your agenda and the last card that we do have here Virgos this is going to be the Queen of Cups which is the guidance followed by the Ten of Cups so what these cards here are pointing that <clears throat> 
whatever you are executing and whatever you are doing, whatever relationship you are in, all right, or whatever project you are trying to push through here by you know experimenting with new um, with new strategies, making those drastic actions, and all the things I have thought for the past 15 minutes, uh, <clears throat> it does point that the more calm you are with the situation and the more humbled and resigned you are by the results that you are reaching at that very moment the easier for you is going to be to adapt to that new path to adapt to these new circumstances and in generally to transform yourself in a such way that everything well that is difficult to explain but you will be at the end you will be very satisfied with the results that you are to reach so um, I'm sorry if I am sounding a little bit um, black or white here but with these cards if things aren't working out for example with your relationship uh, if that was a, a personal reading, I would have said that the person who is asking the question about their relationship, it is not going way, uh, going well. It is because they want way too much reassurances that this relationship is going to be lasting forever. All right. So these are people who are always thinking that their partner is cheating on them, that their partner is not good on their own, you know, or that this the person that it is asking here always have to contribute into something so that thing can be um, can have a, a positive finish and etc etc you know and uh, basically what you're doing here if we're talking about relationship establish it one is that you are stifling the person that you are with leaving them to do all the chores and leaving for yourself only the good stuff which cannot be done you know and as soon as you recognize that and you make the compromise things are gonna go very well because you are to recognize that the chores are the things that actually strengthens one relationship and it, it will be okay if you realize that you have that you are doing things differently from your partner or that your partner is doing things differently from you uh, from you but that that's because it is good because uh, differences are what makes us special into one another and that is just the relationship wise guys I mean career wise it could go in many different ways but <clears throat> you get the general the general outlook of those cards is that uh, your unyielding standpoints stand until this very moment are the uh, are the circumstances which are blocking you to move on forward and a, a crucial retrospection and analysis of uh, previous actions and based on these analysis adopting a, a new strategies and new um, new options no options available but let's say um, you know new way of how you can approach things even though it will be rather uncomfortable for you are required for you so you can stir the situation once again and on top of that you are to see a, a hidden value here so you will be extremely pleased with the with what you are to find with those cards all right as long as you are capable to evaluate your personal efforts so that was the tarot reading for you Virgo and now let me shuffle the Lenormand cards and what they are to show us is a uh, event that uh, you should either uh, look forward to or try to avoid. So what we do have as a first card that is going to be the fox. The fox is, sits for cleverness, it sits for cunning, lie, drama, dilemma, it does sit as well for work. Then we do have the cross. The cross sits for suffering, nostalgia. It sits for sorrow as well. You you get the you get the points. And the last one that is the lily. So the lilies they are sitting for elders. They are sitting for family as well, pleasure and sex. So uh, these cards could be interpreted in many different ways, but one of the green ways how you can, or morbid ways how you can interpret these ways, is that a, a big fat lie is going to come from your family, alright, so you need to be vigilant for that. Another way how you can interpret those cards is that someone that, uh, someone is lying to you or someone is trying to convince you that they love you, alright? And while the only thing that they do is to get into your pants and that's why it will be important here to make the retrospection probably with the previous relationship of yours that had similar results so you can avoid 
you know, being uh, being left disappointed, uh, being tormented, and falling into depression. Very, very important. But overall, here you should be rather a bit skeptical about a. Uh, how can I place it about fast success and fast and easy success and be more prone toward you know the hard labor type of success the the hard way around so that being said guys this was your weekly tarot and Lenormand reading I hope you enjoyed it and you liked it and once again uh, this was a general reading for Virgo star sign therefore it's going to um, <clears throat> differentiate in in resonance with every single one of you in a different level if you want uh, your situation to be uh, put through an uh, analysis here with tarot cards well that is a subject of a personal reading and for personal readings you can check out my website which is listed down below in the description of this video and there you can find a full list of my services as well as their pricing Rod signing out now see you next time bye